Good morning with the mono brow tan this morning. How lovely. Had an amazing little breakfast with Laura this morning. We had some scrambled eggs, some tiger bread toasted with butter, some salmon and some avocado. I didn't go nuts like I did kind of last time with the pizza and whatnot. I didn't feel like I wanted it, but I just wanted to sit down with Laura, do a thing that we've done loads and loads of times before on a Sunday morning. I cook our scrambled eggs and some breakfast and just a nice little time to spend it together. So that was really good. I'll do a little reflection of the show later on today. Um, still wake up, feel great. I mean, I, I did want to just try and beat my best national placing of fourth back in the juniors in 2009. And I smashed that with a solid second place yesterday. So I am pleased. But I'll do a full roundup later on today, like I said. We are up relatively early and we're going to go and head home. I'm still at Laura's. Um, going to go into Bromley, do a little walk, get back on the diet. Yeah, get back on the diet, get back on the steps. Gonna go into Bromley, like I said, and go and do Marks and Spencers and get some dinner for tonight. I think we're gonna have a stir fry. It would be quite nice. I might compensate a little bit because my breakfast would have been really high in fat today. I'm not gonna track it, but I will compensate a little bit in the day where I'll just have less carbs. Um, I'll probably miss out any rice or noodles or whatnot for tonight and just have loads of veg. Uh, and then that's kind of it, really. Just getting back to the diet and then back to training tomorrow. Try and scrub this tan off. But yeah. Look at it, it's funny isn't it? Weird old bodybuilding. Yeah. Right, so we're struggling to get the uh, the se <laughs> third second place trophy <laughs> in somewhere. This is huge. Um, really, there we go, we'll have to maybe do some adjusting. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> second place, second place, second place. They're getting bigger at least, that's the main thing. Yeah. Quite like second place, this is also my second place medal from the BDFPA British Championships, and that was from a third from ages ago, but we'll forget about that one. <laughs> there we go, lovely. Do love a little bit of autumn in old London town. It's crisp, get the jacket on, chill out. But me and Laura are gonna walk into Bromley now, get my steps back up, so back on the diet, and just continuously getting back on it, which is tough. Got home, got back, had a protein bar, some fiber one bar and an apple. And then we're gonna go in, get a little coffee. I think Laura's gonna have a green tea, a little cheeky green tea. And then go through Marks and Spencer's, do a bit of shopping there. Maybe just have a wander around. Yeah, just have a nice lazy Sunday, to be honest. Walk in, walk out, get 10,000 up, get home, cook some dinner, maybe watch some Netflix. That's it, really, a bit boring. <laughs> vanilla exfoliator thing and to the nice security man who asked me why I was doing a time lapse be nice next time don't just assume that I'm some sort of weirdo After finishing that pretty epic stir fry thingamabob that I'm finishing off pretty much today, I'm going to have a mug cake um, just to make sure my protein levels are high. I kind of estimated and tracked today's breakfast, but it wasn't as accurate as I'd normally, nowhere near as accurate as I'd normally be. But I just had wanted to have an idea just to see what my protein levels were. So I'm going to have a mug cake and some Greek yogurt with a little bit of syrup. But that, that is like a big bowl of uh, stir fry, two packets of the Marks and Spencers. Pea shoot stir fry with some prawns and some butternut squash noodles and then a little bit of mayonnaise and some barbecue sauce. So easy meal, tasty, absolutely fine. I said earlier I was going to do a little review of yesterday. Long day. Checked in at 10am, didn't get finished until what, half nine? 
maybe, I think. Half nine, I was on stage and done. The middleweight, uh, relatively big class, about nine, I think, was in my class. Placed second. So, kind of like two things with that. Like, this is my third second place in a row. <laughs> third second place in a row. Uh, Sam beat me last time, obviously, as you've seen from the vlogs previously. And again, we were toe-to-toe -to -toe on stage. We... I went in the first round of callouts. Uh, I went in this third or second round of callouts, and then it was me and Sam at the end getting compared once again. It did come down to I think uh, size and condition. Um, uh, I think I was in as good, if not a little bit better condition than last time. A little bit fuller as well. My carbs were higher. I weighed in at seventy six kilos on the day, so I was a little bit heavier as well. But again, not quite good enough to tip Sam, and he took the middleweight title. But second place, that is my best nationals uh, ever in bodybuilding. So my last best was fourth as a junior in 2009. And this time now, yeah, second place at the NPA British Finals. Really, I'm really happy. I'm kind of like half and half. When I started the day, I was like, oh, I just want to get this done. Maybe a top three. And then I started to realize that, yeah, you know what? I could win this thing. So that kind of drove me on. Uh, two weeks today, this is Sunday, two weeks today until the UK Drug Free Bodybuilding British. That's going to be a massive show, 130 competitors. Not sure of how big my class is, but I'm going to presume it's going to be in the tens. Really looking forward to that. That's a big. That's the biggest natural bodybuilding show in the UK, and I'm very much looking forward to being seeing what kind of fish I am in the big pond. If I guess fourth, second place, I'm going to be, oh man, I don't know what to think. But we'll just wait and see. Again, the target's top three. Again, the target's just to get back on the diet. Maybe a little bit higher calories today, just based on the fact that I had the breakfast, but well-deserved. Back on the diet tomorrow, back to training, just grinding it out. Last two weeks, see what I can do. Yeah, gonna chill out, relax with Laura. I've got a Louis through thing to watch tonight, that mug cake, and then it's done. Hopefully I can get caught up with these vlogs. Again, I don't know what number I'm on. I think I'm on 174, maybe. So we'll go with that. Day 174, episode 174. Done. Right, here we go. The beautiful bronze for the runner-up trophy. And today, that goes to... Gordon Greenhorn. Come yeah. on, well Gordon. Here we go, getting a magnificent Sergio Bronze in only his fourth ever competition. He's now a two-time British champion. Let's hear it. Sam Slack. 